going back to Will, Will made a great point earlier. He said when College Hill aired, I guarantee he got a boost in ratings. Yo, how many of us wanted to be on College Hill when we saw that jump growing up? Uh, <laughs> oh, that, again, no surprise. Yo, I knew, I was like, yo, all right, knew I was going to a &T, I might not have graduated like, if I was on College Hill. <laughs> Bro. What the amount of, but here's the thing, though, that goes back to the point where if it's put out there, that exposure, it makes people aspire to want to do that, you know? Yeah. So if we saw more lawyers, doctors, dentists, people in the medical field, pursuing entrepreneurship, whatever. If you saw more of that happen, if they aired more of that, people would aspire to want to do that more often. Mm -hmm. And that's been my biggest pet peeve with the with media. You know, so I'm thankful for things like YouTube and all this other stuff where people can just upload their own stuff, but it's a <laughs> gift and a curse as well because people are also uploading a lot of coonery, a lot of foolishness. So it's a oh, it's it's a double -edged, it's a double edged sword. Exactly. Don't watch it. Don't give them views and things like that. But one thing I do hope to see before we before we all leave this earth is the, the tide change where it goes back to, all right, let's have those. For example, in the 90s, you had so many black sitcoms that were yeah. actually some good. I mean, that and actually they were had good, a positive yeah. message. Yeah. Acting, and good they were quality, good. Say that good again. Message, good acting. <laughs> Everything overall good, baseline good. I can take this a step further, and this is probably gonna piss a lot of people off. Music in the 90s, the artists mm -hmm. actually had talent. Like, you actually had to have mm -hmm. bars. You actually mm -hmm. had to I don't deliver. think you're pissing Act anybody off, bro. I don't think you're pissing <laughs> anybody <laughs> off. There's gonna be so many people born <laughs> after 1994 that just destroyed me in the comments. Oh, you're, you're pissing me off. <laughs> when, when they go back and listen to the music, they could be like, yo, franchise was zoned to some shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the thing is, like, it goes back to my point. Like, just that era was just the golden age for not just music, but just media in general. Like, everything, it, it was a balance. I guess that's the word I'm looking for. It was just a lot of balance. Like, granted, you had your twerk songs, you had your party anthems, you had this, that, and the third, but you also had conscious like, rap. Thank you. Yeah, that's you what I was looking for. Yeah, but we don't we don't really demand that these days. That then that's definitely don't point. definitely don't demand it. That's, that's my point. It it's, it's, not, it's, it's not out though because people are not. It, it's, we don't demand it because people are not putting it out because they know that's not the way. Because your J Cole's and your Kendrick's man tend to tend to tend to get uh, heavy love out here. It's just people yeah, don't define, define, but, heavy, but love. define you said. heavy love. Look what you said. Define love though. If if you, you know think how long about it took them though. It's two, like, we always revert back to two people. That's all Kendrick we know. And your code. It's, it, and you're right. That's what I'm saying. That's all like, I know. Totally. <laughs> but yeah, one late was part of that crew, too, though. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's throw that in it. See, that's, 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 what I, well, that's what I was having this conversation about early, earlier today, that a whole lot of rappers that we had that conscious rap from, that's when they was hungry. And then they got paid more. And everything, yeah. and then that that conscious kind of yeah. fell off. I gotta make the club bangers, yeah. and I'm like, man, yeah. it goes back to yeah. Dominique's point. Yeah. It goes back to exactly. It goes back to Dominique's point, man. It's all about the consumer, and I hate it. But it's like, but that's all we're giving. Like, how many people are actually putting good conscious music out at a high level? I mean, now, I, 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 I mean, people. How, how many times? And this, this is just putting it on. How many times do we look for it though? Not at all. 